everybody. My name is Peace and popularly known as Black Love. I'm a law student and for your information, I'm the last one in my family. That makes me a baby girl. Welcome to the Banter Room, a space where we're about to about plenty of things. A podcast that will bring you the insights, latest news and insights on Nigerian students. You see, on this space, we'll be discussing plenty of things, lots of things. You all should know what's up, from student issues to love life to pressing issues in universities. Drinks are talk. You see that drinks are talk, eh? That's my own favorite thing. Me I dare, my core dear, my just they talk my mind, me and they cry for this place. But anyways, you should just stay tuned, get ready to be informed, entertained, and inspired. And as for the host of this space, I would like to introduce biggest A's and they my co-host into this space. But then I'm going to give them their time. I'm going to give them the floor to introduce themselves. So biggest A's, please take the floor, Remy. As we also today and said. Which is the promise more is, but then no offense taken. I'm here today to talk about the Bantari, which is a podcast that means more ideas and more of everything that people as a student. We had BK's day. Premium just go day. She has said it all. We had BK's day. Buy it. Day. Day. So yeah, I'll be um, inviting one of our co-hosts here, Mr. Ing, to give us more ideas. What's up, Nigerians? My name is Ayi. And throughout the episode, you can just call me Larry. I'm an aspiring philosopher. I'm a part time content writer. I have a computer in short, I'm just a banter. To, to all of you that are here to be familiar about the banter room, the banter room is going to bring you premium. After all, um, Black Law has said a lot about banter room. For me, I'm going to tell you the most fun part about it. If you have that letter that you want to send to your ex, thank you guys thank you very much as you have seen those are my co-hosts we have biggest ace in the building and we have Ain day welcome to our first episode hmm. it is time to talk the real talk so guys our first topic for today we'll be talking about the challenges that comes with being a student entrepreneur let me go first first of all being a student is very very hard i'm a law student see, I can, see that one no, you can never argue with me law students is it the fact that we're going to read we're going to cram we'll write side cases being a student is already hard itself now student entrepreneur you like that right i'll be a few biggest days what can I'm you say, going to say right thing. but then Oh, sorry, I cannot relate because I am not. I'm just a law student, please. Uh, yeah, okay. Because I cannot message my daddy that I want to buy a week. I want to go me. Okay. So now I have to work my ass off. Work as a student. Yeah. Aside the fact that my dad is going to be paying my school fees. Yeah. My house rent. Yeah. And all of the minor things parents should do. Yeah. But I need like anything like that. I cannot tell my daddy I want to buy a Obviously. Impossible. But I have to work my ass off to buy it for myself. To work I mean, what this can't I'm not imagine that game. Oh my god, please stop, stop, stop. You told me that you buy everybody. I'm not saying Okay, well this is the money you're possible. But then I said you want to buy everybody. Cheap go for a go live for two. No, even though but for upon even though the guys are for still I should bomb when you get a jelly. But then, to be very, very honest, being an entrepreneur is very, very hard. See, in fact, challenges to work well being an entrepreneur is a lot. So we're talking about that thing in this episode. Being a student entrepreneur, it is very, very giving, you know, the fact that you can get what you want anytime. As long as you have the money, sure, probably the money that you've made from the business, I think as you can afford it, yeah, it is giving. But then, the challenges that comes with it, it is a lot. Well, then, let me just how do you feel about balancing it together? I mean, being a student. And then being an interest. Ah. <laughs> you see, about that is a, is a lot. <laughs> being a student and an entrepreneur, for you to balance the two together. Ah, you know, it takes a lot of nerve, a lot of seriousness, a lot of persistence. Of, is this persistence? Persistency. Ah. <laughs> That's like the That's a, yeah. <laughs> it takes a lot of consistency, you know, to balance the two together. If you are studying, I don't want to like discriminate courses now. But for example, 
I'm studying law. Please, you know, I'm I'm studying law. Law is a law. Excuse me, you don't have to be so vulgar, please. But then anyways, as a law student, you know, law is a very very bulky course. For you to balance law and then your business, it takes a lot. When it comes to exam period, some people, some most of my classmates now, when it comes to exam period, like two months to exam, they have got to show that business, they will shut everything down, no more business for like two months. Actually, they want to focus. Do you get it? Actually, I can relate to that. Exactly. Because in my house, mm -hmm. like, the house that I'm living, mm -hmm. I have my neighbors too. Like a month or like two months before so exam. the exam, you will hear them that they will be like, okay. And we are not going to cook, we are going to buy something like exactly. Like, time that they want to, like, read. Maybe they are doing all this. Our only kitchen, yeah, but those are all this. No, 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 like, like, like cook for their uh, like, themselves, like, to do that for themselves. As a business owner, it's a lot because now I can be in Harbor, my business is not in Harbor, I can okay. be anywhere. Oh, my business is in Lagos. So, I'm gonna balance the two together. Um, if I'm to attend to a customer, yeah, so, sometimes my customer do um, tell me that I'm. They need me to go and get what they want for themselves because of size. Sometimes I might want to deliver something, and maybe a person is wearing a large size. Uh -huh. And I might tell my supplier to deliver a large size, but my supplier might be del delivering an extra large. For, for that, my customer is going to lose my trust. So sometimes I go myself, I'm going there, I might be having classes. Exactly, or exam self. So you're not balancing this together. I don't know. You don't know. Do, but then I still, I still give you my time, I give you my all to balance it together. So therefore, I have a dispatch rider. I mean a trusted one that helps me with it. And I can say that since he has been helping me with it, yes. 90% of the time it does well. But sometimes ten percent, some people still complain. Exactly. It's just that ten percent can spell business for a business owner. It's just that balance it is thin eh? between the systems are different. You can balance it and that best no balance up. They'll just shut down. I'll be like, I'll get paid. Imagine telling the dispatcher that to deliver food. I want it like they're eating the meat for delivery. Is that one business? What kind of trusted business or a person is that one? It's not the business owner. Even though? It's who is trusting the business. Not the, which is the dispatcher. That one does not concern the buyer or the kidney. Business is business. I bought you. I which tested is why you. why it is hard to balance the two together. So actually, when you see a business owner, give them kudos because yeah. they are trying. Actually, they, they should, should we give you kudos to what are you to saying? Because kudos to those that are trying to balance it. Actually, me, there are a lot of people. <laughs> Imagine there are a lot of people that are actually trying to like they are always like trying to balance their education and their entrepreneurship. Mm -hmm. Like most of them, like I myself, I, I know like two or three maybe four, five self that are actually balancing school and are doing very very well. Okay. Because some people still give excuses that okay because I'm a student. I'm because uh, I'm catering for myself and I'm going to sponsor myself. I'm paying my schools and all. Um, I, I don't have to be serious with school. There are some people like that. Calm down. Are I you trying? People that are like they're doing three four businesses. No, I and, feel yes. business on its own is different and school on its own is another different thing. Are you not balanced? You have to balance. 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 And, and business. business. Yes, it is. I've seen people. Like I know someone that actually graduates in this very school that has been about three or four businesses and she graduated well. She was yeah, I know someone too. Where in oh. computer science, the first class. Yeah, and she has two business. Two business. She graduated with what? First class. First. Everybody's not I like swear. kicking on shame. Most of us just say, um, "What's that?" Yeah, untouch class, in relax. <laughs> yeah, <for> everybody. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Alaga, yeah. Sunia, yeah. first class. First class. Exactly. It's just that woman in tech. Intake. It's just that in this life, eh, we have part A and part B. There are some parts that majority can never take, and there's a part that majority can take, and majority cannot take. For example, now some people can balance school and work together, business together, and some people they cannot balance it together. But those that cannot balance it together, eh, those are the ones that we have issues with. And most of the maybe if you can't might... balance it together, then why are you having a business? business. It's not easy. Do you like being broke? Do you like being poor? Why you act like you know you have a, you have money account? Like plenty money. <laughs> they want to try to do something new now. It's not your it's not a fault to be honest. But really, that kind of challenge is a lot. And being a student, I don't know. I really don't want to be you a student. That's a fair point. That's a fair when point. You are coming but to school. You, you are coming to school and you are doing business. Like I think if you are catering for yourself, like you are sponsoring yourself mm. into your business, I think you are supposed to be the one that's more that should be 
serious. Because you know, no, I'm, I'm not catering for myself. Let me use myself as an example. My dad, my mom, and my brothers, they still do cater for my needs. But then I'm still focused on my business because there are some things I need. Things that I want. Sure. Yes, my wants. The parents are they can only provide already. my needs. Yes, but my but wants, wants. They can't provide my wants. Shame me that I'll see girls with thirty-two inches. Exactly, but ah, Jesus, ah. Man. let me just show you because I can never relate. Yeah, I can't. Yeah. Ah, he's spinning me. <laughs> what do you call it? Yes, if you are a student, you have to live like one. That's it. Relax. If you can't say you want to buy that thing, she's clear. We're saying deep wave. Hey, no, from no. Because you, no. you want to buy from that, you want to buy. You have a girlfriend. Don't let us go there because there are Let's some there are some girlfriends that are like sports girlfriends. And now that's the truth now. Some girls that are friends. Yeah, so uh, none of them are asked you to buy them. Eh? We are in the banter room to talk about it. That <laughs> Actually, <laughs> lot of challenges. But then you see, this is the reason why I have that to work myself because I can't ask you. <laughs> now you can't ask. No, now if you because have. You if if I'm she can't even ask you. No, can't. Because can you It's possible now. I can ask my male friend. If I'm Why dating you, friend? if I'm dating you and you are a student, you know I'm a student as well. And you say, okay, you said you want to buy. Most Why are you dating calm as down. a student? Calm down. You, you said this now that you said you want to buy most. So calm down. Most of the students, most of us, you know, you you know, you know, you know have. You are still trying to talk about balancing. Have you? You want to say you don't have boyfriend? I don't have. have. You, uh, you fine. You don't have. Fine, you too, you know, but there are some students that this are like, is, did I tell you? We are not even talking about relationship here. Yeah. Wait, oh, about business it's, and school. We are not talking about it here. Yeah, oh. Boyfriend yeah, or not? You know people pushed it far. You asked the yeah, question, sorry. and I'm trying to like. Okay, let's to let's you. come back. Come you back. Said, okay, come back. Come back. The other time, yeah. you said you're like, okay, um, what if I have a girl? Like, there are wants and need. Yeah. Like, say, okay, for you now, she said, for her, if she wants to buy a clinical thing, and I said, if you are a student, you have to leave. That means said, uh, me. That no, I have to that. live like one. You that's why I am sense. hustling. Exactly. Uh, that's why I'm hustling. Uh, 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 no, uh, I don't have to be a student and act like a student. Exactly. My words are different. Exactly. This is what different. I want to. Uh, this is the way I want that's to live my life. Working. This is why I am working to provide right, for at least even get what this I want. now. Why am I not working? If you can't even balance it together. So like you mean like if I'm on DD every time, will any guy Sorry, have interest? What's DD? I love attractive you. What's DD? What's Didi? I they avoid guys like this. Oh my God, <laughs> Where the talk say Didi? Hey, you, you see all these guys? You know, you oh, Didi! Am <laughs> <Day. laughs> I might not love that though? What should I be doing, Didi? <laughs> ah! You see, there are some girls like this. They will just wear one very big top. They, they are the most attractive. You know, That's a lie. Like, hey, one got skinny. So nature is beauty. I don't understand you people. Oh, what, what do you don't understand here? How would you want to marry me? So you feel like you find a girl on Didi attractive? Very, very. They are always looking. Well, good. why? But then I'm not. I'm not trying to like. I'm not trying to like discriminate against people that actually want to buy bone straights or they want to buy something that or they want something for themselves. So it's normal for you to like want luxury. It's normal for you to like want to buy something. Yeah, yeah that's luxury. Okay, for you to, okay, to get the luxury that you want, if you that's cannot balance for you and you work together, one will suffer. Is that like academic? Some girls actually they get their suffer. luxury from other things. things. Like maybe so yeah, balancing is already hard, but then the Lord helps students because we're also trying our best. Mm-hmm. And yeah, there's this point to that. It can be difficult for students, entrepreneurs, to establish credibility and gain the trust of potential customers due to their age. Wait, speak English. Oh God! <laughs> oh, that was, I said, like, but, like, for example, students so entrepreneurs, it will be hard for them to gain trust due to so their age. Trust. Yes, yeah, like yeah. potential customers like, now, they'll be like, ah, like students. Do you understand? Yes. Because of that, business will not, business will not even boom. So not like students entrepreneurs, not like they're trying, not like they're not trying their best to make that like business. Like I don't want to buy something from a new person. I don't to, like, know. Gain the person trust. Yeah, exactly. Especially if he's now a student. And online again. For some that we've never seen before. And most of students are some vendors. I kind of patronize them. I don't even know you. Everything just. But I feel like thing. you should always give vendors chances. 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 Um, that that goes, yeah, my last savings. I don't want to disappoint. I should buy something. I should bring something else. I should give them chances because of my own money. No, no, I cannot use my own money as something like chances. It's not really possible. Really possible. I'm so sorry. <laughs> the last thing. Because I'm always happy when people I don't know patronize me and they buy in bulk. They always give me joy. Sorry, me, I'm not saying anything. So I'm not. I cannot do that. I'm sorry. Can you do that? <laughs> I cannot do that now. Be... So you guys are not promoting students' business, me. No, it's not like that now. Okay, what if someone actually? What unless um someone actually? You cannot even blame most of 
um, people that they don't patronize people that they don't even know, but due to their age, it's not their fault. You just see this girl, ah, this person sending something, ah, I'm more 10 years old, I'm more 15 years old, eh, make it. It's just like that. That's just how life is. It's just going to be like that. And actually, it's not I, this. We can't actually blame this because most of these students, it's not what they like portray that they are selling that they are actually selling. That they Imagine all this, most of these are not even that they are selling goods. Look at. Let's not even start with them. what I ordered, what I got. Mm -mm. Let's not even start with no, that. No, we don't that. That's not what I'm going to say. That's not what. That's where we are going. We will get there. Calm down. Calm down. We will get there. It's all this. Most of these people that are selling stuff online. People are aware that um, it's not as if that it's not. That is not the stuff that he wants to sell. Yeah. That they are selling, that's, that's not the exact thing that they are selling. But I sell what exactly what, what I'm trying to say. Relax. I'm not talking about this. Relax. 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 I do buy from Wait, other people Wait, too. Like, I sell mostly men, they're, they're but like, I buy my female wear from other people. Oh, oh, I think I understand. I mean, I mean, that, okay. I'm because of, because I added due to their age. Yes, now they now want to now post something about um, the stuff that they are selling. Like, okay. uh, you need to work in the company, this can just come. Hey, is it below or That's what the most of this stuff Okay, so let me tell you, if I'm posting so, post 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 only the clothes, will you hurt me up? Yeah, I can't Isn't that why you are seeing that is attracting you? Guys. No. They are carrying me to that place. It's <laughs> <laughs> the truth. It's the truth. <laughs> hey, now, because most of these students, that's, that's what people believe. So I don't blame people if they say they are not going to. But I feel like people should actually them, people give should actually, yes, they should. them chances. They should. But you see, life. But, are you lame? But see, oh, uh, no, but you have to. Yeah. Um, all these um big brands, so they fuck people up. That's true. But then you know we're talking about students. Small business. So students. Small businesses. It's not like it's not. Sometimes easy. you patronize a student and you'll be marvelled like, wow, I'm too. impressed. If you patronize me now, you'll be impressed. As a student. I don't even trust myself that much. So now trust vendors again. That's a lot of risk that I don't think I can take. Like you can't just come to me just one time. Oh hi, sorry. I'm this, I'm this, I'm that. I sell this thing. I'll be like, oh yeah, I'm gonna patronize you. Life does not work that way. That one part where it's a major challenge that comes to being a trend stripper, you know. Right. But then yeah, actually students are actually doing very, very well with this entrepreneurship. It's all about trust. It's all about trust. I could remember it's not trust, trying. it's just like giving it a try out. Yes, I could remember there are some that I want to try. Because I could remember a time that we were just sitting down in the class. I think we were having a class that time, like story logic or something. Then we were having an hour break, then we saw someone. She said, she said what she called? She said Coca or something. She said she's an artist, she sells stores. The way she like she articulated as she articulated the whole thing. Even if like, you're not interested, the way you she buy organized the whole buy. business, like <laughs> I feel it's much you it say it so persuasive, like persuasive. But she, like, I'm not saying that they cannot she, buy. She did but the other, we don't even trust. Well. Like the, those type of students, are people who surely want Patrons. to patronize them. Well, maybe. But um, I feel like another challenge mm -hmm. is like people trying to sell, sexualize them just because they want to buy from them. Imagine okay. as a clothes vendor. Mm -hmm. One Pablo wants to buy from me now. Okay. And just because I'm a girl. Does it have to be Pablo? <laughs> uh -uh. I'm just using an example uh, now. now. Because many guys now, Pablo, Pablo, yeah, no. Pablo. Like so now, buy it from me. You've seen a fine girl now. Mm -hmm. I know my. I want to impress her. Uh -huh. yeah. <laughs> I think so. Hey, now, you go. I'm kidding, you guys. <laughs> yes, now, you want me, you now text me that. Come and deliver this thing just because I'm looking for a means of livelihood. Like, I'm, look I'm looking for a means to survive. If you want like, to You have to do everything that would take. Yeah, to get the money, I'm it's actually suffocating though. As having having to go through that. See, see, these people that are actually like, I saying, eh, because I want to buy something from you, I want to just come and buy it from my house. Hold on, I'm coming to Okay, go on. And then I'm you know, like, okay, me, I felt me, I don't know about others. Like my, to my own opinion, I felt mm. if some girls like are not placing themselves that way, like okay. they are not doing stuff like. Okay, Do you what wow. kind of stuff? Let me explain that oh, one. There are some wow. vendors. Relax. 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 It's something uh -uh. that they are interested in. Okay. It's a lie. Chill, chill. chill. No, you never you know, you know, you, um, you never I, like, like, sometimes my <laughs> only posting my business will not attract sure, you. Not no, <laughs> no, like, only posting their business might not attract you. So they are posting another thing that might have your interest yes. for you to want to patronize. Relax. But that was not me. Blame. You have to sexualize them. We cannot just, blame some just because they are portraying themselves in that way. way. We cannot blame some people. For example, somebody is sending luxuries. Ah uh, ah. Uh, there are some ways that are very very bad. God will bless. We you. have luxuries that it's just your husband as receives your man. But no, because you want to patronize something, you will wear it. 
Ah, ah. If there's no night, like, even if it's me, I will sexualize the person. <laughs> Till the day. No, no, like it's just just. But the there's some people just... do it in a very irritating way. Yeah. Like having to be like, okay, like. For all vendors that sell clothes now, mm -hmm. guys really feel like vendors that sell clothes mm -hmm. as a girl, mm -hmm. like because you are selling, you have to come and deliver. Like I've, I'm not, I'm not speaking for myself now. Let me speak for other people. Like I see online, they just post the screenshot of ah, um, I want to buy this thing, or like because this guy wants to buy this thing, he's asking me to come and deliver. Mm -hmm. like, oh, imagine a guy asking you how much for a night because you are trying mm -hmm. to promote your business. Yes. Yes. God bless you. I'll take from you. There's, there are some people, there are some, there are some, there are some people in this kind of business. Hmm. Girls in particular. Yeah, girls in particular. They're selling stores, they're selling clothes, they're selling this. Before a guy can actually come to your DM and be like, okay, I want to buy stuff. You must have done some things. Is it there for the oh, have a sexy down, body? Calm down. Yeah. some girls that be like, there's some girls that be like, before a guy can actually come to your DM and have the audacity. The F on trees. To be like, okay, uh, how much are you selling? Okay, how much is per night? How much is per night? There are some people, in, in, like, there are some girls no, that some, are No, some guys are very insensible. Apart from being, guys being insensible, there are some girls that are doing this that they'll be like... Some people just feel off. like, basically, this girl, now what she they said with this? Now what she go they do? I'm not going to lie. I'm not going to lie. Most of the time, men is always at fault. What you're always posting is always different from what you want to pass across. You want to sell something. If you are posting something like I ah, ah, LA okay, like now you want, well, like, you want to buy a dress for yourself. Wait, wait, wait. Let me let me something. You want to buy a dress for yourself. And now you are just seeing the picture. Mm -hmm. I feel like some people when they want to buy something for themselves, mm -hmm. they want to see it on somebody's body to know how it will look like on their body. But if the girl that is advertising the pic the clothes is not sexy, and you yourself you are not seeing it on a sexy body, will you buy it? Yes. Sexy Even body. though, sexy regardless, sexy body, sexy body, uh, new order, but that's how the clothes is looking like new arrivals. New arrivals, new guinea girl, guinea girl. Is that how it's supposed to be? It's not supposed to be like that. Well, sure. Plus, actually, those are one of the challenges, and it's very rampant. Yes, people should like. I feel like guys too. Guys, too. yeah, they should, they yeah. should like, they should stop embarrassing all these people that are trying to sell stuff online. Yeah. Trying to make there are some genuine but then, vendors anyway. Apart from that, exactly. Apart, no, 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 but apart from that, we can't that, them. That's just the problem. Guys alone. We can't actually blame the guys alone. Because apart from that, there are some girls too that it's not what they are selling that they are that's selling. That's selling. Let's let me You said relax. Yeah. Yeah. I know that is the truth. You say, say. So we are all bad egg have spoiled business for other people. Yes. That's just how it well, is. Well, people that are actually selling stuff out there that are trying to like make a living for yourself, like people should just try and fucking nice. Exactly. What do you feel about all this this part right now? Like I feel they are also part of the challenges that are that, that comes student entrepreneurs that are facing actually. What should you feel about them? Hmm. You said you are doing business, you should have, uh -uh. You should have more business on a biggest taste. You should, you should, you should. <laughs> well, well, I don't really have issues. We we'll see this part right okay. now. Okay, let's not I do let's not personalize but then, it. Generalize yeah. it. Yeah, let me just generalize it. Okay. Now that there's even I can um full oh, price. Yeah. Is worse, of course, obviously. Because how am I supposed to um get a um a client that I delivered to for two k before? And I'm supposed to pay five k. I had I was going to order something from Aja mm -hmm. to the mainland, and the girl was telling me the delivery fee was six k, just because I want to buy skates. Skates, skate how much? <laughs> skate of nine k. Delivery fee six k. Why? Everything is amorted to fifteen k. So I, that did, that did not even make me patronize the, at all the lady yeah, yeah, or or uh, as a business owner selling food. Uh, I'm now buying food of let me just say maximum three k. Mm -hmm. I don't eat that much. Mm -hmm. Now you're not telling me the dispatch that is telling me I'm going to be paying two k or three k. Sometimes some people are wild and now there's there's I can full price. Yeah. Might be might be more. Mm -hmm. That's like before. So I feel like it's going to um affect students. Yeah. Well I'm talking about professionals mm -hmm. for the, let's not now talk about students. students. It's going to be very very harsh because, on them. Yeah, yes. Exactly. Because for somebody to buy something from you mm -hmm. in school is love. Because me I'll be like if you don't do your hand I will come collect them for your house. Uh -huh. Ah that's all right. <laughs> that's 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 money. And now telling me that dispatcher there is saying eh, 3k. I feel I'm not going to buy it. I feel most of these dispatchers are too. If you send them a message, you send them something, most of the time, if it's food, 
Ah, uh, uh, relax now. Just like, like, like some. Me uh, uh, I'm not like it's a big issue. It's not just like small issue. It's not a big issue. Come on, you are all real jelly jelly. That one is not a big issue. It's a very very. You no, start food business now. I let them start trying to eat your meat. It's not even. I don't even need. And doing that kind of stuff. Or maybe you are ordering the food. I saw now it's my food. Ah ah, it's not a big issue. But I'm very sure you drag the vendor. Not even the only vendor that will drag. Then Me the and that is person that they will know us. Because what we use, the, uh, uh, what we use the food that they sent, they sent you to the person to me. Mm. And I said, of course you are hungry. You now open the food and you eat it. Some people have their fortune to tell you, boss. Now meet your permit and send your money back. Ah, <laughs> the one should go to beg. <laughs> God please. <laughs> ah, sorry, this <laughs> is the truth. Because wait, because all this is much right it's, it's it's becoming very 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 rampant. Um. Like. They are causing a lot of stress for all the students. Oh, imagine calling yeah, they are causing stress for Sometimes you call this matter that I do something for you. This matter will say, don't come here again, I go deliver your thing when I like. No. It has ah, happened to me before. Let's even think about that behavior. Ah, this part right now. Oh my god. I don't sell very bad. Hello, driver. Hey, Joe Bolawa. Ah, hey, bro. I don't put me down. I'm like, ah. She may have my money. No, I'm gonna pay your fee. On night drive. Oh my god. I have to leave all over. I don't want to be a part of the I feel like I can't even do anything today. That's not correct. But one time, one man tried with me. I changed it for him because I think I was frustrated that day. I was frustrated that day, but then the man was like, I want to be a being a student really really sad and then very, very being a student Ima- Ima- imagine coming back from school on that ps son as a student and the driver is calling to come and collect your Good. goods and he's not acting that way to you like you know so frustrated. frustrated like that oneself the mental head's already to like zero it's already declining like this being, in, being an entrepreneur is a lot. I, I don't know. Can I even add it? I don't. Close to every student out there that are trying to like balance their school life and um, business life. Huh? And um, all, these, um, all these people that are trying to like patronize them, you should, should be lenient to them. Be nice. Well. be nice. Be nice. Be nice. Stop passing them out much for nights. They are not selling yourself. Well, socializing them, to, please. They are trying to make a living. <laughs> for and then to it. most people that are actually finding it very difficult to make it in the field of entrepreneur, you can go into something else. Every one of us is born with a gift. Yeah. Like some of us, might not even be someone, it's all of us. We are born with something. Yeah. I don't like, even if you are not born with it, I don't mind there's something that you what very, might be very, working very for A might not be working for B. You get there are something that you'll be very, very good at. Not to just be consistent yeah. and you have to be committed. Yeah. No commitment you never start. Yeah. Without consistency, you will never finish. And you need proper orientation. Be oriented. Hello. Okay, so guys, we've heard it all. The challenges that come to be. Not like we've heard it all, but like most parts or most challenges the one we could touch. That, yeah, that comes to being a student's entrepreneur. If your job is to be an entrepreneur, please you can be entrepreneur make money spend money and if your job is to be somebody's baby girl please anything you want that can suit you please do it now to be somebody's baby, baby girl okay. it's that you want anybody that, anybody that works girl. for you please do it i got bouncing baby girl hi i'm i'm somebody's baby Brand my baby mommy's baby. child <laughs> mommy's last child please baby. anyways that is going to be the end of today's episode yeah, it's not going to be the end so there are some people out there that have let out to their ex Ha! You just caught me shot! Okay, we are at two or three safe now. What's going to get? Yeah, straight out of our heads. Oh my god! You've been in a relationship before? Yeah. You've been in a relationship before? I don't believe you. Are you playing? Biggest. Sorry. Sorry, sorry. You have a letter to your ex. You have something that you need us to talk about. Yeah. You can subscribe to our YouTube channel you and drop the comments about the topic you want us to talk about. Yeah. 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 Yeah.